I saw an interesting speech by KTR, K. Tarakaramarao of the BRS, Bharati Rashtri Samiti. And uh, it had a couple of highlights, which I think need to be introspected a little bit more. But before I go into that, I want to just tell you the lay of the land in Telangana. Is the MIM aligning with the BRS or are they going to go with Congress? This is not a question that has been asked yet. I think so far the indications are that they will stay with the BRS, but one never knows. Why do I say that? Because suddenly the BRS has become toxic. Kavita Rao is in jail for the liquor license problem. I also uh, am hearing that KCR is unwell. He's not active. Uh, maybe he is not strong enough to campaign. So the entire burden of campaigning has fallen on the shoulders of ATR, the sun, the air incarnate. Now, what is happening is that he has been essentially lying. He says that we will not allow CAA to be implemented. I mean, I'm getting tired. KTR actually has worked in the United States, in the Silicon Valley, in some of the hardest startups. For him to indulge in these kinds of bald-faced lies is just, you know, it's very sad, that's all I can say. The guy is a bright uh, guy, very can speak well, he uh, communicates well. and uh, But today in this rough and tumble of the politics, he's essentially lying through his teeth. Another thing he said that saying Jay Sri Ram is not going to fill your stomach. It's not going to get you jobs. My friend, you may want to talk to the Muslims in Ayodhya. I'm hearing that they are experiencing a windfall. Why I'm saying that is would the same KTR say something like this about Quran? Would he dare even open his mouth about Quran? So why just keep on poking Hindus? Why keep poking fun at Jai Sri Ram? What is it going to get you? Because right now, in my opinion, the BRS is nervous that the Muslim vote might navigate towards the Congress. If that happens, then what little uh, you know captive vote bank that they had that's going to go up in air. But also remember, guys, KCR is from a very small community of Velama Naidus. So there are not that many of those. So you, he's not like a Lingayat community. I'm, I'm going down to the caste level math also. You just try and see if that can play a factor in BRS's fortune. So at this point of time, in my opinion, the BRS is probably going to be either second or third, depending on how strong the BJP is in many of these places. And I think. It's going to be an even fight between these three. Who knows how many each of these parties are going to get. Uh, the takeaway here is at least keep the thing about decorum and please don't lie. It doesn't behoove you, KTR. It, it is not, you, you can say anything. You've already done a lot of damage to your reputation by giving some promises that you cannot keep. For example, 15% reservations for Muslims. You cannot do that. They are not considered to be somebody who need any help. All these things tell you that the era of regional parties is coming to an end. I give 5 to 10 years and then all of them will be gone, including Biju Janata Dal. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to